Hi there, this is Robin Ray with stories to engage your mind. To be or not to be by writer Robin Ray. Decisions, decisions. We just got done with Christmas shopping. Now we've got Valentine's Day coming up. Easter is just around the corner. And we've got this whole brand new year ahead of us. What are we going to do with this new year? Are we going to just react to things and let that be our future? Or are we actually going to make a choice on who or what will be in our lives this year? Whether it's big changes or just a few small ones, we really do have a say-so in what we want in our lives. By thinking about how things worked for us last year, we can determine what worked and what didn't. Then we will be able to make new things happen. We need to make new decisions to have new actions take place. Sometimes it's hard to make decisions. Many of us just simply react to what is happening and that takes up our time and energy. What if we actually started to be more aware of things? Then we could make the changes we want. We would not just be reacting to our situations. We would be making new things happen. What if we aimed for happiness this year? Now, that would be great. It could be our year of happiness. I guess we would really have to think about what makes us happy now, not what made us happy five years ago, because, you know, things have changed. We have changed. If we look at who we are now and what we like to do now, then we can build on our happiness. We might need to make some simple changes to be happy, like smiling more, seeing more things that make us laugh, being kinder to people, making new friends, doing a fun hobby, and relaxing more. Maybe, just maybe, being happy is making things less complicated. Whatever happiness means to you, my friends, I know that you will make it happen this year. Until the next time, enjoy the journey. Cheers, Robin Ray.